The date is July 30, 1985, and we are at the former Baltimore and Ohio Yards at East St. Louis, Illinois. CSX Corporation owns the property. CSX was formed in 1980 when Chessie System merged with the Seaboard System. CSX wouldn't have its own identity as a railroad for another year, but the beginning of the consolidation of the two systems is evident as power from both stands by. At its creation, CSX had two parallel lines into East St. Louis. The southern of the two was the former Louisville and Nashville line from Louisville and Evansville, Indiana. The other was the former B&O from Cincinnati and Vincennes, Indiana. For the first several years of CSX's existence, the two lines would be operated as they had before the merger. As time went on, however, through traffic would be shifted from the L&N line to the B&O, and the western portion of the L&N would be abandoned from East St. Louis to Oakville, Illinois. Bell Rive, several first-generation Jeeps lead a pair of GP38-2s on a westbound through freight. The seaboard system look still dominates in this July 1986 scene. GP40-2, number 6556, still wearing her original c &O colors, passes westbound. With trains of CSX, Norfolk Southern, and Union Pacific, Mount Vernon was an attractive railfan hotspot. Through freights on the former LNN, however, were on borrowed time. By the time these scenes were filmed in September 2000, the west end of the L&N had been abandoned. This left only the occasional local freight to operate on this line, and catching one was often a matter of luck. Turning back the clock to 1985, we are now on the former B&O line to East St. Louis at Salem, Illinois. Salem is another crossing of Union Pacific's Chicago subdivision, and UP maintains the former C&EI yard here. An eastbound CSX freight is shoving a cut of interchange cars around the connection to the UP and will continue onto the yard. On the point are a former CNO GP35 and a former BNO GP9. Eastbound train number 372 passes at Xenia, Illinois, 18 miles east of Salem. C number 370 one last time, passing east of Shattuck at dusk.
Shattuck, Illinois is where the B&O crosses the former Chicago, Burlington, and Quincy line from Beardstown to Centralia. Cotton Belt and Southern Pacific Power is again in the lead as westbound R-241 pulls through town. of C30-7s in a GP40 lead an eastbound R372 across the diamond at Shattuck. While the interlocking tower still stood, it was no longer in use. <laughs> 